There are not many hotels that can compete with the Adelphi Hotel when it comes to history. The Adelphi Hotel contains an abundance of stories spanning the last two centuries. It all started in 1826 when the hotel building was opened. But the hotel's start was not a great beginning and so 50 years on from its grand opening, the building was knocked down and the second Adelphi Hotel was built in its place. The year was 1876 and had no resemblance to the first hotel. The new Adelphi Hotel was more of a luxurious feeling. It was known as Liverpool's leading hotel. This hotel brought on wealthy visitors, one of which was Charles Dickens who visited during the 1800s and listed Adelphi as one of his favourite hotels. He visited three times between 1826 and his death in 1870. Over the years, Adelphi Hotel has been hailed as Britain's most haunted hotel, linked to a wide range of ghostly behaviour. Sightings of men dressed as naval officers wearing dark jackets with white caps were seen before quickly vanishing. Creepy handprints appearing with the strange, unexplained noises have been heard on demand. Lifts have been reported moving on their own. The feeling of being watched by something lurking in the corridors, along with being touched by unseen hands has also been reported. The ghost of a man known as George has also been reported who can be seen standing next to your bed during the night while he watches you sleep. George took his own life at the hotel in the 1930s. Reports have also been talked about a demon that resides on the third floor of the hotel. And guests here have fell violently ill during their stay. Reports of growls, disassembled voices, and the feeling of someone being choked have been reported here also by a malevolent spirit. An unknown whistler in the lift likes to breathe down the neck of guests before disappearing. Other reports that have occurred is the female pickpocket ghost that has been seen rifling through guests' clothes and belongings and then when challenged, she disappears. Raymond was a 15-year-old page boy who died in 1961 after becoming trapped in the baggage room lift at the hotel. He has been reportedly picked up the luggage of guests and carried to various rooms before he suddenly disappears. feeling of someone walking behind you along the empty corridors to your room have been reported. Only when you turn round, nobody else is with you.
It has also been reported of someone sitting in a chair, only when spoke to, disappears. Have you stayed at the Adelphi Hotel before? And do you have what it takes to spend the night in Britain's most haunted hotel? Links below.